here, Sharice Myron at Trinity Lutheran Church, and we're here to talk about the Crop Walk. So, tell us what that's all about. Sure. Um, it's the first actual walk that was done to raise money uh, for a, a cause. Mm -hmm. So, back in the 1960s is when it got started. Um, this one here that we're hosting at uh, Trinity Lutheran has been hosted in class, and now this will be our third year, but it's the 28th year overall for this particular walk. So it's for a great cause, obviously, you're walking for hunger, and um, how do people get involved? How do we get to the crop walk? When is it? All that good information. Okay, sure. Uh, the crop walk is May 6th. It's a Sunday afternoon. Registration starts at 12 o'clock here at Trinity Lutheran, and the walk itself starts at 1 o'clock. Mm -hmm. uh, to get involved, uh, the website is easy. It's www.crophungerwalk forward slash Troy MI for Troy, Michigan. That's where it originated, so mm -hmm. that's why it's Troy. And so if you go right to that website, um, you can sign up and create a team. You can sign up as an individual walker to raise funds, or you could uh, sponsor a walker mm -hmm. there too. So obviously you should all come to it. You should start a team, because um, for, for a great cause. Um, how long is the walk? The walk can either be one and a half miles or three miles. Mm -hmm. the, the normal walk is about three miles, but we do have a shortcut back to the church that's marked as needed. Yeah, I mean, I've done it, uh, I think, both times you've done it so far here. Right. It's been a great time, and it's really not that far to walk. No. <laughs> so, um, what else do you want to tell us about it? Um, um, there are ways that if you can't walk, or maybe if you own a business here in Clawson or Troy or Royal Oak close by, we're, we, um, we do a fun gathering after the walk. Mm -hmm. So a big reception, free food, we give away prizes and raffles and things like that. So we always like our business partners here in Clawson mm -hmm. to come out and um, we've had great participation from a lot of them donating food, donating raffles coupons, things yep. like that, so it really makes it a fun event. Right, and it's kind of a party afterwards, so yep. you get to walk and then you get to have fun. Yep. So, uh, anything mm -hmm. else? I mean, I think you can give us... Well, uh, just a quick update. So far, we're at about 141 walkers, wow. uh, estimated. Our goal has been 200 walkers, mm -hmm. and uh, last year we raised about $15,000. Our goal would be to get to the $20,000 mark at some point mm -hmm. uh, while we host it. So. That's our goal, so we'd love more walkers and more business participation. Can you register the day of, or do you have to pre-register? You can. Okay. Yeah, you can register the day of as well. Yeah. Yep. All right, awesome. All right. Anything else about the crop walk? Anything going on here at the church? Um, that's our big thing coming up. We obviously have uh, our Gleaners event. We, we uh, volunteer at Gleaners as a church. We bring in outside groups. We've got, obviously, the AOK -okay <laughs> Theater Group joining us, as well as some other folks. And um, that's, a, that's a good event. That's on April 28th. And we do that at the Warren Distribution Center. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, thank you so much. Um, come to the Crop Walk. I'll be there. The Acting Out Kids will be there. And a lot of other great people. So come to the Crop Walk. And thank you so much for talking to me. Thank you, Madison.